got ourselves team one together with Cole Class and that unkillable warlock. We got a crusade over on the warrior with lots more on the evoker. See Buzz as demonology with totem maids. Bringing all the totems and bringing the maids in. Dead guy over on team two. Probably the most accurate name. Lethal strike. We got Varg. We got on how ass. Open it up first with Skull Clouds. Trying to go for the most amount of damage over time. Conquer Shadows. Skull Clouds. Trying to see if we can back up out of it. The, the dots are just melting. The boy, though, may be in a bit of trouble. This assassination rogue dots are just melting. The guy can't even respond. Literally goes for a mad heal. Just to recover all this dot damage. As I think on how ass. Was waiting for those dots to do work. Dropping down Cast and Circle. Trying to see if he can go for big drains versus on how. He's going to be dropping in a big cancels from the portal. And he just needs line of sight of on how assassin if you want to catch up to him. Have himself the board, have himself the gate, which he may be able to utilize it to his advantage. And how assassin goes in for the grow, trying to establish the most amount of control versus cool class. <laughs> As he does, uh, do dives into a dome, looking for a slow onto on how does it for a shift just to slow down the warlock with the infernal around the corner, dropping in more portals, trick us out of the blind, got us a play to mobility. And how it says dives in a cell, but he sails it down on him. If he ever pokes out a cell, the portals should attack him again, shouldn't they? Try to go for an interrupt onto the castle circle, but couldn't quite do it. So he has to find a way to deal with all this drain damage. Got himself a shadow step, but a mortal coil is gonna send him back out in the open. And Kukla's going for massive, massive trades. Can the shot got himself a port, big can to lobbed out of the portal. Sepsis onto cool class does have a dark pack in case he needs to. That's where on how goes in for the most amount of damage over time. If he's playing that, um, if he's playing King's Bane, I think he may need to stay on King Cool class as, as long as possible. Not let the dot damage run him down, but rather ramp up the damage of the uh. The passive damage of the poison. This could be potentially the play. If he has himself the full go, this could be the play to do it. Does he have a Cloak of Shadows? He does go for the full set of dots. Maybe Cloak of Shadows. Cloak of Shadows to try to not give Kulkas any opportunity to heal off of it. Try to see if he can summon some portals. This one, how he needs to find a way to interrupt any kind of self healing. This one, Kulkas looking for the full recovery. Trying to go for trade. Why he's in Castle Circle? He can't really be interrupted. There goes the Dark Pact, but he does lose out on the borrowed health. He's very, very limited what he can do. Maybe this is where the rogue can dismantle him little by little. Just used to wait a little bit longer until the dark pact is gone. Landing the interrupt. There goes the sepsis. Lost the damage over time. Eventually, dark pact is going to fall off. It's absorbing so much of the poison damage. So much of the bleeds. Now it's gone. The health bar is exposed. This could be really bad for cool class. Going to be an ambush out of one how. Used to get a garot on him to interrupt him. Maybe a kick. There he goes. I think he may have gotten the war. Like, now does it. I'm taking him down. The assassination rogue. Find a way to dismantle and take apart the destruction warlock let's see if it's gonna be up next oh no from one warlock until the next oh hopefully assassins are ready here Ambush out of the rogue with a grow to follow. See Buzz going for a port really, really early. Sending out the new Dawkins versus on how. Who got himself a massive, massive cold blood. Able to get himself a fatty crit. Gonna be Boros. Wait, all oh, those eyeball demons. I have a cool dance joined in. He got himself the lucky prog. Those eyeballs are doing so much damage. Look at him doing work. And how is that in a tight spot? These eyeballs are just relentless. They're still attached to you. Staring into your soul, burning you from the inside. Axe toss, Demon Doggers. I think it's going to be over as Seabuzz does take him out. Varg is playing that cheesy survival range build. See if he can maybe make a play versus Seabuzz. Seabuzz is going to go for Mortal Call. Quick fear with the Demon Doggers. Varg pop himself to Iron of the Fittest. Try to see if maybe he can get some demon damage onto Seabuzz. That's going to be explosive shot. Trying to go for arcane shots at a distance. And it's going to be able to go for a little bit extra health. I does go for a buff. I'm not really sure what kind of buff he got. Fury of the Eagle trying to see if he can stab him with a bow. I don't know how effective is it. Maybe it actually does work. But Varg is trying to go for as much range as possible. Actually able to live through a good portion of this Warlock's burst so far. Demon Dog is charging in. It's going to have to find a way to tame these dogs. Demon Dog is still charging out. Big bites to follow. That's going to be a, a turtle as he gets rampaged down by the army of the Legion. Biting shot onto the Warlock. Varg trying to get some damage onto Seabus. And Varg is kind of limited what he can do, but he's actually starting to crack through defenses of the Warlock. Mortal Coil. And actually, Varg got some plenty of survivability. What is healing you? I'm not even sure what's healing him. But it's got a lot of self survivability right now. Axe toss and Seabus trying to see if he can lock you down. Hand of Godons back to back. This is where Varg wants to close the gap. And this duel, throwing in grenades, dark back now, but Seabus stabbing him with a bow. But it's gonna be Demon Dog charging in fate death for just a second. Varg no health. Oh, Demon Bolt does crash on the side of him. I don't know how are you surviving there for a second. You had plenty of healing. What was that? Lisa's trying to be up next. Trying to see if we can go for Clock or Shadows. Immediate stone, full burst on the Seabus. Seabus is kind of limited what he can really do. I think that was full death pact, isn't it? 
So if that was not that pack, that's Mark. So it's gonna be all the bleeds ramped up. Could be in a big, big trouble. There's gonna be a lethal strike taking a lot of damage too. Poison bomber to see, but trying to see if we can want a lot of it. It's gonna be going for the gateway. Lethal strike is just surrounded by the armies of the dead. More to call as he goes for a shadow step. Fear in the opposite direction. Not really doing great on health either. That's gonna be a fell lord join or fell uh not fell lord. Fell guard joining and fell lord are a lot bigger. Oh, big damage to lethal, maybe in trouble. Oh ho ho! I don't know what C bus did to that guy. But it did crush him down. Is it gonna be that guy next? That guy jumping in. Leaping in, literally charging out on C-Bus. Trying to see if we can take him down. Big spirit to follow. Seabus kind of surrounded. Not much he can really do. Reflect up for that guy. Seabus trying to see if he can take it up with wall. This man is just an indomitable force. That guy's the one actually getting blasted up by the tyrant. Wait, this could have just been turned around. Trying to go for a fear. Does Seabus have any more mobility? Trying to get a couple of handicle downs. Wait, he can still lift this. Big condensed by that guy. Trying to see if he can take him down. Seabus just ruining his soul. Just trying to see if he can fight right through it. More to call. That guy may be in a bit of a bad position. Oh my god, Seabus. What are you doing to these boys? Demonology Warlock, man! Unstoppable! Oh my goodness! As Leroy tried to see if he can veer around him. This is where Seabus is gonna have to be very, very careful. Gonna be a full silent sigil. It is gonna go for a trick, maybe a little early. Could use mobility to get out of here. Big dark pack as Leroy tried to see if he can crack through those defenses. Seabus needs to escape it immediately. It's gonna be Mad Hunt. I don't know if he's gonna be able to get out of this one scot free. Unless he got a Mordekal or some kind of heal. I think it's over, Seabus. There's no way, right? There's no way the Demon Hunter finds his target. Lath Walker is going to be up next, immediately hitting Leroy with a fire breath. And it's trying to see if he can disintegrate him down. Root onto Leroy is going to be dropping out of darkness. Try to see if he can avoid Lath. Lath is trying to see if he can delay his damage while he's sitting on darkness. Going to go for big mastery damage. Try to see if he can catch him for Leroy, missing that big dragon breath. But almost gets him. Disintegrate out for Lath Walker. Trick it, follow him. Leroy trying to see if he can avoid him. Big immunity. As he's looking to escape out of here, running for his life. Looking to maybe get himself a little bit more resources. Fired up and ready to go. Big soul cleave. Lath Walker trying to see if he can use the mobility to avoid him. La Leroy kind of overcharging, over uh, over leaping away from Lath. Overshooting a little bit. Lath with big rocks to follow. They were looking to slay the demon, picking up the demonic soul. That's where Lath Walker is going to go for as much self-healing as humanly possible. Trying to get himself as much of an opportunity to escape with a big... <laughs> <laughs> big chain, big heal, big damage as last. Looking to continue the pressure versus Leroy does go down though. Crusade is the last one left as a Fury Warrior. Needs to find a way to fight through Leroy. Why he's got that meta, it's gonna be difficult. It's gonna be spawning in a quick demon, a quick Shivari he can slay behind the pillar and use it to leech some health. Check out on Leroy, just to make sure you can take down the demon. Stun back into Crusade. Crusade may have to be thinking about defenses. Mad damage out of the demon hunter. Crusade trying to see if he can recover all of it. Leroy, as soon as he's done with that damage, the hit and run strat, skull is behind the pillar. Crusade charges out at him, trying to get some bloodthirst healing off him. And Leroy is avoiding him entirely. Quick hunt as the warrior charges in. That's gonna be a full pet stunning out. Oh my god, Leroy. <laughs> they can't be doing it to these boys. They were, they've been nerfing Demon Hunters back to back. You can't be doing that. See, Buzz with a 4 0 or 4 1 rather, was having himself a hell of a run against these rogues, blasting out of these boys.